Oh, snappers, you guys ready for some more Terraria? I am so... Oh, my God. I was going to say I'm so ready to party, but uh, it would appear that these guys have... Uh... Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. These guys have very much beat me to the party here. Oh, that ain't cool. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Oh, in every sense of the word, I am... I'm going to die here. Uh, huh. Unless I kill them from the bottom. Oh, that actually kind of worked, huh? All right, maybe we could try and get those other guys to come over, huh? Come on. You know you want to try it. You know you want to try it. <laughs> come on. Full victim to my amazing bladed glove. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, I am actually a genius, ladies. Is that another pinky? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, my God. I did see a pinky. <gasps> oh, my God. Guys, we've got to go ahead and kill this guy. Oh, uh, I feel like luck is very much on our side when it comes to pinky spawns. It would be so cool if I could potentially get for myself. Oh! Darn it! <laughs> well, on that note, it is time for me to welcome you back to the Terraria Let's Play. I do hope you guys have a fantastic day. We're back for episode four, and I hope you guys are having a lovely day. I'm having a great day, my friends. I'm actually having a lot of fun with this series. I truly am. I really do hope you guys are enjoying it as well, because I've been enjoying taking it a little bit slower, you know. I'm not all about progress per episode. I want to make some progress per episode, but I'm not going too ham over it. I'm not worrying too much about it. I kind of like having you guys along for the ride, and I really do hope that you guys are enjoying the slightly slower pace as well uh but yeah as always my friends i do want to begin by saying a massive thank you for all of the amazing support you guys have been showing i do truly appreciate it what the hell wow we've got wall hacks going on here guys you see i'm not entirely sure how i feel about that because i can't do that freaking jerk what is up with these guys they could just hack their way through walls that is not cool, boo-boo. Come on, come on. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Not taking me out that easily, sir. All right, is Pinky still here? I think he may have despawned. Darn it. All right. Well, I guess we're going to have to take down this guy and get my coins back. This is basically a mini-boss at this point, guys. <laughs> when guys have 330 health against you, yeah, this is basically a mini-boss. Oh, for God's sake. Come on. There you go. Oh, all right, guys, I think we need to get out of here uh -huh. as soon as humanly possible. There we go. Right, yeah, you can you can come over this way. And I'll back you into a corner. Yeah, cool. All right, let's get out of here. Let's quick stack our coins away at the very least. <sighs> all right, there we go. Looking pretty good. Ah, vines and jungle spores. Remind me, sir, what is needed for the ivy whip? A void? What? Wow. That's kind of cool. Void vault can be used to store items. Stored items will only be accessed by you. Oh, so it's kind of like an ender chest. Will contain items picked up by a void bag. If carried, it may pick up items when your inventory is full. This pocket dimension is out of this world. Ah, oh, dude. All right, so clearly it's Skeletron tier because it requires bones to craft them. But damn, man. Basically an additional inventory, right? That's nice. Anyway, so back to what I was looking for. The Ivy Whip. We need seven more jungle spores and two more vines. I kind of want an Ivy Whip to be able to be... A to be able to be able to... Oh, my God. My grammar is so bad. <laughs> to be able to freaking just grapple to surfaces... It's such a game changer. It really, really is. Ah, uh, I want to do it, man. I want to. I want an ivy whip. Ooh, hey, a new tree. How about it? I love it. I love it. All right, come on, baby. What you got? More gems? Uh, no. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, that sucks. Ah, uh, well, crumbs. There's me thinking that giant freaking hornet was the only one. Uh, no. Why would that ever be the case? If you come across one, you'll come across 17,000 of them. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh. You absolutely hate to see it, guys. I mean, no amount of health potions would have been enough to avoid that death. Let's just be honest here, guys. Hey, goldfish. How you doing? 
All right, so yeah, we're going back down to the jungle because I'm just an idiot. I just want, I just want cool drops, okay? Simple as that. You want to go? I'll go. <laughs> the bladed gloves are no match for you, sir. Hey, Sapphire, thanks. Appreciate you. If we find more rubies, that'll be cool. But we do have a small collection starting to grow, which I think is very, very nice. So yeah, I don't think we've got too much to worry about. All right, let's pop down here potentially. Let's see what we got, huh? What you got for me? Uh, oh, hey. oh, crap. Oh, double crap. Oh, that's just rude, that is. Yeah, I'm not 100% sure we're going to... Oh, God, are we going to live? I think we will, just about. Oh, God. This is really freaking bad, isn't it? <laughs> All right, well, I'm making the noob box, guys. Come on, buddy. Another mini bus. Potentially another vine or two. Can these guys drop multiple vines or is it only ever one at a time? Uh, yeah, you need to die, sir. All right. Oh, well, there's a hornet. Oh, yeah. Gotta be careful. Come on. Come on. We can do this. Ah, jump. Jump shots. Jump shots. Come on, Python. Your Call of Duty skills need to come into effect here. What have we got? One vine. Darn it. Ah, we need more than that, my friends. Definitely need more. Oh, god damn it. Now we've got this freaking guy. I don't want this. I don't want this at all. Go on, Finchy. You can do it, baby. Oh, snap. Oh, my God. My Finch is just going up against the world right now. <laughs> Meanwhile, I'm just safe and sound in my little safety box. <laughs> Go on, Finch. Do all the work. Give me all the epicness that I need. Hey, do you know what would be super cool? Is if I actually got enough resources to maybe make like a thorn chakram or even the blade of grass. Can you imagine having that at this early stage in the game? I don't think I've ever had it this early in the game before. I'll be honest with you. We, have we got multiple hornets now? I don't want that. That ain't cool at all. Nah, dude. Get out of here. There we go. Again, a safety box. Man, you gotta do what you gotta do, alright? To progress. And live. More to the point. <laughs> oh, snap! All right, well, this has definitely been worthwhile. We have at least found ourselves a heart crystal. There we go. How about it, huh? 180 health to our net. Oh, there's another one up there. Well, holy poop. Come on. <laughs> Dude, the amount of slimes I'm freaking killing, I feel like I frankly deserve a slime staff right about now. No! Oh, you son of a... Oh, these guys could just... They've got so many different shooting attacks. It's just crazy. Well, thankfully, I didn't have that much money on me. So, in all actuality, I didn't really lose that much aside from my life. Um. <laughs> uh. Ooh, in the meantime, how about another couple rubies or so from this tree? Oh, snappers. Look at that. We've got three of them. Holy crap. That might actually be enough. I think that might be enough. So, I've been farming rubies between episodes, and the fact that we just got three from that one may have just topped us over the edge. It may just be enough. All right, so let's just check this out. Yes! Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Right, uh, anvil. There it is. Yes! <laughs> Look at that. Oh, it's got plus mana cost, but it's also got plus damage. 24 magic damage, dude. What a freaking upgrade. Oh, fantastic. All right, guys, I'm, I'm feeling a little bit better in my ability to survive now. And more to the point, to take out those pesky little jungle dwellers. <laughs> oh, sweet. All right, skeleton banner. Oh, that's going to make this farming so much easier. Oh, my God. <laughs> all right, we're just going to make sure that they're always spawning more. Um. Oh, snap, dude. Oh, this is so much easier now. Oh, Ancient Iron Helmet. Nice. Okay. Well, I mean, it's two defense. We can all... Well, we've got a choice here. We can either increase our defense by one or have the permanent thorns effect. I mean, to be honest, I think the thorns effect is going to be the thing that we go with. I mean, not unless we get ourselves an ancient gold helmet, which, again, according to hashtag Wikigang, we can... Okay, we just got a second Iron Helmet. Great. Great. If we can get an ancient gold helmet, I'm about to be super freaking happy, dudes. Oh, sweet. Just got ourselves a regular hook. That's kind of cool. All right, so strictly speaking, if we were to head back to base and combine some chains, 
with that hook, we can make ourselves the most basic grappling hook you can make. So according to the Terraria wiki, hashtag wiki gang, uh, yeah, the bone sword is apparently a 1 in 200 chance of dropping from these skeletons, right? So I think that's a percentage chance of 0.5%, which actually... Yeah, it's rare, but it's not that rare, you know? We should be able to get it pretty soon, like. So yeah, ladies and gentlemen, I kind of decided that the method I was using to kill the skeletons before was just a little bit too slow. So here we are with our pre-hard mode fetid back knacks going ahead, going at it, killing the skeletons, and th oh, this is just so much easier, dudes. It's so much freaking easier. We should have the bone sword in no time. Although I say that, look at the amount of banners I have now. At least 600 skeletons have died today, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Can we get a rip for the skeletons and chat? Or you could just do it the old-fashioned way and just jump on the pressure plate yourself. Uh, this might arguably be the fastest way to do this, actually. Uh, if only I had a program that allowed me to just press the space bar over and over. Oh, finally! Oh my god! Finally, ladies and gentlemen, did you just see it? The massive bone sword. Oh, mama. All right, please tell me it's auto swing. Okay, it's not auto swing, but... We've got a 5 damage increase compared to the keen silver broadsword. Look at the amount of hooks we've got, man. <laughs> oh, man, that took a while. Gee whiz. Well, well, yeah, I wouldn't even exaggerate when I'm saying this, but like over half of the entire recording session so far today has just been me pounding those skeletons into the dirt. All right, so, uh, well, what is even the point in going to the jungle now? I mean, there is a life crystal there. I guess we could still try and get one of those bad boys. Yeah, I mean, why not? All right, so I'm going to put these two away. We are going to put... I mean, we could probably just sell these hooks. Uh, for now, I'll put them in here. We'll grab the chains out, and I'm pretty sure we should be able to make... There we go. The nice basic grappling hook. Is very nice. I'm a big fan of that, actually. Very, very nice indeed. Okay, so... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. We've got so many skeleton banners, man. That is so insane, isn't it? All right, how many rubies are we going to get from one harvest here, huh? I mean, obviously, it would be nice if all five of the trees had grown, but, you know, you got you got to take the good with the bad, huh? Let's see just how many we get, huh? We'll probably go ahead and wait for the other one to grow before we go ahead and decide that we want to put anything else in here. But, uh, yeah, for now, that's not too bad, huh? We've got six ruby gem corns. Very nice. Ah, so we didn't even need to build a loom before when we were going about the whole bed goal. Uh, yeah, th 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 there, was, there was one there. Uh-huh. All right, well, yep. Python, once again, being as observant as ever with his exploration. <laughs> oh, dear. You'll have to forgive me, as always, guys. Sometimes I just can't see the obvious. It's just a thing. It's a genuine weakness of mine. Yeah, give me that. Look at that. 200 health, ladies and gentlemen. Very nice. All right, so what have we got around here? That is the question, isn't it? Oh, the hook. It's so nice. I love it so I can move around easier, guys. This is so much better. It's so much better than just jumping and using ropes. I mean, there's nothing wrong with ropes. There really isn't. It's a fantastic early hard mode, uh, early pre-hard mode thing to have. It really is. But there is nothing like having a grappling hook. Even just a simple basic one. Holy crap! You are kidding me! Dude, I just spent all that time bombing out for the bone sword, dude. And there's one of these things here? Mate, you've got to be freaking joshing me, dude. That is the second time in a row I have found an enchanted sword shrine out of its biome. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I'm so mad with myself. I could have just explored a little bit more and came across 
that enchanted sword shrine, dude. I actually can't believe it, bro. What is that luck? That's unbelievable. Like, that is actually, truly unbelievable. Oh, for God's sake. Well, yep. <sighs> I'm going to be having skeleton nightmares tonight, ladies and gentlemen. You know how I'm the king of flower pots in Minecraft? Well, in this game, I am the undisputed king, okay? The undisputed king. Oh, wait. We are the undisputed king of enchanted swords. Like, th there's just no doubt about it, guys. There just isn't. There's no doubt about it. Hey, buddy. How you doing? All right. So, strictly speaking, if we're still going for the whole ivy whip goal, we need seven more uh, thingies. Yeah. Also, there's this guy up here. I kind of want to capture him. I know that you're supposed to follow them and all, but low-key, I kind of want to try and capture it. Although, at the same time, maybe, maybe maybe we could just do a little bit of a follow-follow. Let's -follow. see where he's going. Right? Maybe the red one leads to something epic. Maybe... Okay. Oh. Uh, ha! Nope. Nope. You know what? I'm going up here real quick. Ain't no way you're getting to me, sir. All right. Well, we'll see. Oh, oh, it's a shrine. Nice. Thanks, little fairy. I appreciate it, broski. Yeah. Thanks, bud. Appreciate you. Appreciate you a lot. We've got some epic stuff here. Come on, fiberglass fishing pole. Oh, ankle of the wind. Okay, very cool. I will take a honey dispenser as well. That is pretty darn awesome. All right, anything down here? Oh, dude. I'm so glad I've got the freaking oh, grappling hook. I'm so happy. It just makes getting around so much easier. I feel like a king right now. What? Uh, Python was decapitated. So I could have sworn I just got rid of all of those thorns, but uh, maybe, maybe not, huh? Maybe not. Well done. <laughs> Here we are at home once again. Dude, I am honestly at this point just looking for jungle spores. How have we not come across any more yet? All right, lead me to something good, baby. Lead me to something good. Yeah, that's not good, is it? <laughs> Pressure plate track. Since when was that a thing? Terraria, you sneaky devils. I can't believe that. All right, well, yeah. I genuinely did not know you could get pressure plate tracks inside this game. Huh. All right, well, you know what they say. You learn something new every day, huh? That's definitely the thing I've learned for today. Terraria are a bunch of sneaky buttheads. Yes, yes, that's what I've learned today. <laughs> ah, okay. So, I have a feeling that I just wasn't deep enough in the world to find the jungle spores. Yeah. I guess that would make sense, huh? I always thought that the jungle spores could just spawn in the generic underground jungle layer. But I think you need to go to the underground cavern jungle layer in order to find the spores, right? I mean, that would make sense in which case why we couldn't find any before. Uh, so, yeah. Okay, cool. We, we can... Oh, hello. Hi. How you doing? Where are you off to? I mean, I'll follow you. Where do you want to go? Where do you want to go, huh? This way? Are you are you just going to be my faithful companion until you find something? I mean, I guess so. Cool. I mean, I got a little loot companion. I like it. <laughs> oh, oh, it's found something. It's found something. Ooh. I tell you what, I found something as well. This, yeah, this just looks like death. I'm going to be honest with you guys. This just flat out looks like death. <laughs> All right. Well, we do have a minecart track here. Oh, my word. This is such a bad idea. Okay. Right. Let's see if we can take this sucker out first. I want to find out where he's leading me to. Come on. There we go. That's that guy out the game. We could take this guy out as well. Okay. Maybe I'll just sort of dig down. Come on. Is it is it another is it another shrine? Ah, it's a heart crystal. Thanks, Green Fairy. 
Oh man, I feel like the fairies have been a really good companion for today's episode, huh? <laughs> I like it, dude. We've got some epic things on the go. I'm feeling pretty good about it. All right, so technically speaking, we need two more spores. Then we have an ivy whip. And I feel pretty good about that. Having an early game multi-grapple hook is going to be a game changer, I would say. And also the grapple hook, or the ivy whip, more to the point, it can definitely reach further than the regular hook. So, yeah. It's going to be worth it no matter what, just to upgrade that. Yeah, there we go. 12 on the dot. Fantastic. Okay. Oh, huh. okay. Oh, there's a chest up there. Nice. Mate, that's 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 a nice way to finish off this little session right here, guys. All right, well, let's see if we can get up there real quick. I'm hoping for a magic mirror or a double jump. There it is, double jump. Fantastic. Believe it or not, guys, we are pretty set to take down the Ive Cthulhu and King Slime. I don't think we've got too much to worry about, if I'm honest with you. Yeah, I'm pretty, pretty good about it, man. All right, anything else for anything else? Nah, I think, I think we should quit while we're ahead, guys. You know? It's a pretty valuable lesson to have in life. Learn to quit while you're ahead. And you'll never be disappointed, huh? Alright, so. Uh, wow. What all this stuff, man. We've got, like, Titan potions as well. Ooh, lots of good stuff. Alright, so. Let's pop out here. Let's get the Ivy Whip created. And there you go, ladies and gents. There's our goal for the episode done right there. Alright, and we've also got some paintings. I mean, paintings are quite nice, right? <laughs> all right let's put some stuff in here let's put that hook away and the bone sword already is being retired i'm so sad man we spent all that time just to get an enchanted sword anyway <laughs> oh what can you do huh what can you do all right guys thank you very much for watching we are going to end it right there sorry my voice is starting to go a bit downhill because uh, yeah i've been recording for such a long time now it's like it's like early morning hours now. <laughs> and my voice is starting to get a little bit tired. Guys, if you've enjoyed today's episode anyway, please do be sure, of course, to drop a like rating. I'd very much appreciate it. Hit the subscribe button. And don't forget to ding that bell as well if you don't want to miss out on future Terraria content. But for now, my friends, that is going to wrap it up for today. Guys, thank you very much for watching. Do have yourselves a fantastic rest of your day. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. <laughs>